a small detail that will make you fall in love with the repeater. First, draw any shape, like a square. Next, add the repeater from the Add menu. This will automatically create copies of your shape. Go to the Transform settings for the repeater and adjust the position parameters to set the distance between copies. We want to create a circle of squares, so in the Rotation parameter, we'll add an expression. 360 divided by number of copies, this will evenly distribute the copies in a circle. Adjust the shape parameters to space out the squares for a better look. If you want to add more copies, you'll notice it doesn't work as expected. To fix this, we need to divide 360 by the number of copies dynamically. Link the expression to the copies parameter. This expression will automatically adjust the rotation based on the number of copies. Now, all you need to do is change the number of copies, and the circular arrangement will always look perfect. Let's create an animation like in the intro. Set a keyframe on the copies parameter. Set the first keyframe to 3 and change it to toggle hold keyframe. Move 8 frames forward and set the value to 4. We won't add any more keyframes. Now, add an expression on the copies parameter, loop out offset. The animation is ready. Thanks to the loop out offset expression, the animation will continuously loop between values 3 and 4.